Well, hey everyone, it's the 430 update, and we're just passing through the little town of Shallow Lake. We are already past Owen Sound. The way this had me rooted was, um, look at this, I know exactly where I am. Isn't that right on? Um, it, we only just touched the ed of, edge of Owen Sound on a not busy road that was 80 kilometers all the way through. Unlike the other way, we were actually going right through downtown Owen Sound. So, um, this is just absolutely fantastic. I definitely will be going this way from now on, that there and back. Unless I want to do specifically the scenic route, you know, underneath Georgian Bay, but I enjoy this drive a lot more. We didn't lose anything because of it. We didn't lose time. As a matter of fact, I made really good time. So. Yeah, this is just fantastic. Traffic still very light. Just couldn't ask for a better drive from home all the way out here. And wow, I'm really impressed. Like other than the Aurelia thing, and I can fix that on the way back. This uh, this way to go. This is the way to go, man. It's scenic, it's just not the lake, but it's beautiful back here. It's all the different big farms, small farms, you know, family farms, uh, all the different crops, colors and stuff. There's farms around where I live, but nothing on the scale of this. And you can tell some of these farms, the people have been living there for four, five, six generations for sure. Anyway, I guess that's all I have to report. Um, I guess uh, the next video will be when I get into uh, Sable Beach. We'll head directly to the Value Mart or whatever they're calling the grocery store these days. <laughs> I think it's the same name it's always been. It's the Value Mart. I'm going to pick up some bacon and some... Um, a bit of territory now. Yeah, I've never come in this way. This is just absolute. Look at this, Hepworth. This is so excellent coming in this way. All right, anyway. Savo Beach, next stop. Well, hey, everyone. Um, I'm just back a little sooner. I decided to start recording from here because this is the last few kilometers to Savo. And uh, so we're headed straight to the grocery store. Got to pick Get in there, get in quick, get some bacon, some buns, some bread, and, oh, potatoes. I'm going to make home fries and stuff. Onion, i got to get an onion for the home fries. I'm pretty sure I brought peanut oil. I did, so we got lots of oil, don't need to buy any. Still says 23 Celsius. slowed down it was breezy but I look at the leaves here now it doesn't look that breezy so I don't know Bruce County yay I know it's the place I only visit for a couple of weeks every year and this year longer I always feel like I'm coming home when I come here geez buddy he's gonna blow his motor up passing me there the way he did hear that motor ah there's my campfire wig dude I think that's him. No, I always get mixed up. It's not him, it's the next guy. With the big old oak tree out front. I didn't see the oak tree there. I wasn't paying attention, I was like watching the idiot pass me. We had a few of those. 
goes between back, you know, here and back towards Owen Sound. Three Quebec plated small cars completely packed with their camping shit. Just flying around like little sand fleas is what I call them. They remind me of sand fleas buzzing around. My luck, they'll be staying at White Sands. Although the chances are lower that they're staying there simply because weekdays and empties out there. Unfortunately, that's a really bad thing. Like people don't realize what they've got right underneath their noses. I think I should do a video about this separately. We'll just do a video of the whole area, the fishing and all that, put it into a video, and then wait, you know, I'll videotape, uh, videotape uh, I'll video the campground and everything, put it in a nice little video and put it up on my YouTube. Every little bit helps. If you're not into a bit of noise on the weekend, then it's not the campground for you on the weekend. But weekday, unless it's suddenly changed from last year to this year, or like it's been for the last 20 years I've been going there, weekdays are dead there. I, uh, I enjoy it either way. speed sign they were probably in the right but anyway we're doing 80 now kilometers you Americans not 80 miles an hour uh -uh, no wouldn't be doing it even if I could just beat the shit out of my truck and everything <laughs> even at 80 eh hey Look at these guys pass me, eh? And look at they're turning left here. Big fucking hurry going. Ay, ay, ay. It's four kilometers to Sabo Beach. <laughs> oh, these people crack me up. Especially if you're living out here, like he's may, he might be a local. Like, what would you ever be in a hurry for? Same like right where I live. It's like, I get there when I get there, man. Life is so much easier going when you're just like slow like that. Slow. There's my wood guy. This is him here. No, that's not him here either. Or was it? I think that was him actually. It's just he's got the bags up front, but he's got like one that I can buy a face cord at a time. He's got the, got it there somewhere. Ladies and gentlemen, Sabo Beach, community of South Bruce Peninsula. Wow, I'm really happy. Made it. Oh, I can breathe for a little bit away from home. Way just, you know, sitting around not doing a lot. This will get me more sparked up, especially now all the ATVs running. Boat is up to spec, at least at the basics with more stuff coming good. That's going to get me out into the lakes again around, around home. But this will be a good spark to get me there. I should get some kindling, but 
I don't know if I'm going to have a fire tonight. Lots of gas now, anyway. Driving around here, just going to, unless we go to Tomori, which we're going to. But it, if we didn't go to Tomori, I'd have enough, I would have enough gas just for the old eight or nine days in it right now, without having to put more in. So what did they build where the old, well they've, Got some big piles of sand there now. This is where the amusement park used to be. They tore it all down, closed it. I understood there was an old age home going in there. It doesn't appear that there's anything going on in here. I miss the amusement park here. Not that I ever did it. Future home of Sobble Sunsets, but there's a for sale sign on it. So I guess Sobble Sunsets fell through. For fuck's sakes. That's a shame. They should have gussied up. They would have been better just to spend the money on gussying up the amusement park. Modernize it. Get the kids coming in. They will. I mean, this town is all about that, right? Value Mart. Yep, still the same. There's the, uh, there's the lake. Looks like it's a bit of waves. Not that busy, really. Not really. No, 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 no. Okay, Be kind enough to let me in, folks. Looks busy here. Park my ass away from everybody. And then. All right, folks, I'll be back.